There are this another beautiful day as I welcome you to Menalize TV. So we have started with solving questions under measurement. So under this measurement, we are looking at total surface area of solids. So the solid that we have this morning is square pyramid. So this is the square pyramid, not drawn to scale though. So this is the square pyramid and this is the net of the square pyramid. So this is having a square and four triangles surrounding it. So for us to find the total surface area of this net, so first we have to find the area of the square, then we have to find the area of what? the four triangles that we have. Now when you are asked to find the area of the triangle, first we need the height and then the base. So if the height is not given, we need to find the height using the Pythagoras theorem. First question, which is to find the total surface area of this figure. So when you look at this, this is a square pyramid or square based pyramid. So the square is having a dimension of 12 centimeters by 12 centimeters. And when you look at this, the slant side of the triangle is 10 centimeters and the base is 12 centimeters. But before we can find the area of a triangle, we need to use the formula half times the base times the height. But looking at this, the height of the triangle is not given. So when you look at this, we are going to use the Pythagoras theorem to find the height of the triangle. So when you look at this, the base here is 12 centimeters. So that means when you divide it into two, this is six centimeters and this is also six centimeters. So for us to find the value of x, which is the height, the height or the x, we need to use the Pythagoras theorem, which says that hypotenuse square is equal to the opposite square plus or the adjacent square. Now when you look at this, the 10 centimeters is the hypotenuse. So this is can be adjacent or the opposite, depending upon the question given. So let's assume our x is what is the opposite. So for us to find the value of the x, then we need to subtract the adjacent from what? From the hypotenuse. So we can say that 10 centimeters all squared is equal to So 10 centimeters all squared is equal to 6 centimeters all squared plus x squared. We have to find the value of what? The value of x. So what we have to do is what? Group like terms. So here we have 10 centimeters squared will give us what? 100 centimeters squared. So 100 centimeters squared, which is equal to then 6 centimeters all squared is the same as what? So 36 centimeters all squared plus x squared. 36 centimeters all squared from 100 centimeters squared. So so 100 centimeters squared minus 36 centimeters squared is equal to x squared. So when we subtract 36 from 100, we are left with 64 centimeters squared, which is equal to x. Squared. So since we are looking for the value of x, then you find the square root of both sides, the square root. So that means our uh, x is equal to, so the root of 64 will give us 8 centimeters. So the value of x is equal to what? 8 centimeters, which means when you take the triangle, the height is equal to 8 centimeters. So now that you know the height of the triangle, we can now go on to find the total surface area of this figure that we have here. In the total surface area, we find what the area of the square, which is 12 centimeters times another 12 centimeters. That will give us 144 centimeters or squared. Then plus we have four triangles, one, two, three, four. So to find the area of a triangle, we use the formula half the base times what? The height. Half of the base times what? The height. So from here, 4 into bracket, half of base which is 12 centimeters times the height which is what? 8 centimeters. So from here, 2 here, 1, 
two here, six. So the six times eight will give us 48. So that here we have 144 centimeters squared plus. So six times eight will give us 48 centimeters squared times four will give us 192 centimeters squared. So when we add, so we are going to get 336 centimeters squared as the total surface area of a square pyramid if the square is having the length 12 times 12 and the slight height of the triangle is 10 centimeters. So here we have 336 centimeters squared as the total surface area. Thanks so much for watching today's episode. Remember to subscribe to this channel, Menalize TV, for more updates. Menalize TV when the sun rises.